you know, there are several essential things in life that we never try to go and learn, and then we go through life just expecting that it will come to us. Why? I mean, has it ever occurred to you that you don't know how to make eggs? You could be using this, these skills right now, and trust me, they could be a lifesaver for you in the morning or when you just need a quick fix. Well, let me fix that for you. Today, I will be showing you how to make three egg dishes, sunny side up, sunny side down, and scrim. Now you ask me, how can knowing how to make eggs help me? How is this beneficial? Eggs are a great source of protein, not to mention they're incredibly inexpensive. According to Men's Health, one egg can have up to 7.9 grams of protein. That's a lot considering how small they are. You can get a carton of 12 eggs for $2. College students that have access to a kitchen love eggs because it's a lot cheaper than waste, just wasting their money on another $10 run to talk about. Making eggs is also essential for people to know because it doesn't take long to make. Some people don't have the time or patience to cook a whole meal when they could just fix up a simple dish. These are all important things to take into consideration, and when it all comes into play, they know that making a simple dish such as scrambled eggs will save the day. In order to prepare the egg, Today in my speech, I will be going through the benefits. Um, I already went through the benefits of society, um, the ingredients, and then the step-by-step -step process. In order to prepare the eggs, you'll need a few ingredients such as some kitchen appliances and utensils. I used a large pan, but a smaller medium one will do just fine. You'll also need a mixing bowl and plates. And then you also need a butter knife, a spatula, a flipper, and a whisk to mix the eggs for like the scrambled eggs, but then you, you can also just use a fork. For the ingredients, you're going to need one egg for sunny side up and sunny side down. And then depending on how much you want to eat or make, you can have more than one for scrambled eggs. <coughs> Let's start with sunny side up. Of course, turn the stove on first, and you should have the heat at about medium heat. And then also put a piece of butter on the pan, about half a tablespoon will do. Um, this is so your egg will not stick to the pan. Then you're going to want to crack the egg into the bowl, and make sure you don't break the, bowl, the yolk when it comes to sunny, sunny side up. This is important because you don't want your yolk to be, you want your yolk to be runny when it's done. So when it's finally on the pan, just wait until um, its bubbles start forming on the white around the yolk. And then when that happens, you are done, and then you can now flip that onto a plate and serve. Sunny side down is very similar. Again, keep the stove at medium heat and place a piece of butter on the pan. Then crack an egg into the mixing bowl and then it's not as important to make sure the yolk doesn't break because it is going to be cooked. Now pour that onto the pan and wait for it to start bubbling at the bottom and by the time that happens you can flip it and then it will be ready. Finally, let's see how to make scrambled eggs. This is definitely my favorite. Crack any amounts of eggs into a bowl and then start mixing, with, mixing it with a whisk or fork. Also, it's better if you add a little milk. You can also add cheese into the bowl or you can also add it when you are done with your eggs. Some cheeses you might use are Parmesan or shredded cheddar. When it's mixed well enough, you can then pour the mixture into the pan after, of course, melting a piece of butter onto the pan. Take the spatula and start scraping the eggs to the side. And if you want softer eggs, um, 
you'll be scraping it for a shorter time, but if not for our eggs, it might take a little longer. When that, that's done, you can scoop all your eggs onto a plate. To recap what I went through today, we learned that eggs have many benefits, such as the amount of protein in it, in it as well as the cheap prices, prices of eggs. Um, these egg dishes also don't take many ingredients. And then, of course, I went through the step-by-step -step process, and as you've seen, it's very simple. You barely had to do anything other than crack, mix, and flip. One of these three dishes might just take less than five minutes. Thank you. All right, baby.